When you were a cast member of one of the most popular TV sitcoms of the 90s, it's pretty much a given that people will remember you. That's exactly what Debbie Dunning, the actress and model who played the two-girl Heidi Keppert on ABC's Home Improvement, has experienced. But after Home Improvement ended its impressive eight-season run, Dunning pretty much fell out of the spotlight. Join Facts First as we try to understand why you don't see much of Debbie Dunning anymore. But first, let's take a closer look back at her rise to fame and earliest roles. Dunning got her start as a model. Dunning was born in Burbank, California on July 11, 1966. She graduated from John Burroughs High School, the same school her parents graduated from 20 years prior. During her senior year, she was crowned homecoming queen. In 1984, she won the title Miss Burbank. That same year, shortly after her parents' vacation fund was stolen, Dunning entered and won the Miller Beer Bikini Contest held at Hermosa Beach. The prize was $500, which she promptly donated to her parents to make up for the pilfered vacation money. The following weekend, Dunning won yet another contest. In time, Miller Beer recognized they had a rising star on their hands and slapped her face on a poster and hired her for in-person promotional appearances. It was around this time Debbie realized she might just be able to carve out a niche for herself in the entertainment industry. Dunning soon landed her first on-screen appearance in a commercial for Foot Locker, after which she was handed a myriad of modeling gigs. She went on to grace the covers of sports magazines like Muscle & Fitness, Triathlete, and Shape. It wasn't long before she'd done more than five dozen commercials, including one spot with Ford appropriately titled Pretty Woman. Dunning gained national attention during her prolific three-year campaign portraying Louise in Taco Bell's Run for the Border Girl ad series. With all this exposure, it's not surprising Dunning was able to successfully transition to acting. Besides home improvement, Dunning has also appeared in shows like Dream On, Silk Stockings, The Jamie Foxx Show, and Boy Meets World. She also hosted ESPN's Extreme Bloopers for a short time. In 1997, she played Private Dolores Costello in the critically panned science fiction black comedy slasher film Leprechaun 4 in Space. Before we tell you more about Debbie Dunning, be sure to give this video a like and subscribe to Facts First if you haven't already. She co-starred in several made-for-TV thrillers. Debbie Dunning's first role after Home Improvement was in the TV film The Spiral Staircase, a remake of a 1946 film that was, in turn, an adaptation of a novel called Some Must Watch by Ethel Lina White. The film debuted in 2000 on Fox Family Channel. It starred Nicolette Sheridan as a mute woman who begins to suspect a vicious serial killer is preying on women just like her. Dunning was cast as Danielle, one of the unfortunate women who got trapped inside a mansion with the killer. Unfortunately, Danielle didn't live long enough to see the credits roll. Dunning's next significant role was a recurring part on the soap opera Wicked Wicked Games as Hope Lorca. The soap starred Tatum O'Neill as Blythe Hunter, a bitter woman who was out to get revenge on her ex-boyfriend who left her to marry another woman decades prior. Once again, Dunning's character was also killed, this time at the hands of Blythe. Debbie started her own show on RFD-TV. Dunning has been a lifelong lover of all things equestrian. That's why when she was asked by the Cowboy Channel and RFD-TV owner Patrick Gosh to come up with a new concept for a show, the idea she ended up pitching came to her almost instantaneously. Debbie Dunning's Dude Ranch Roundup premiered in 2017. The series, which Dunning both stars in and produces, revolves around her love and passion for touring dude ranches and horseback riding. In the 2017 interview, Dunning explained her vision for the show was to explore all the dude ranches in the U.S. while highlighting what makes each one special. While she was still a cast member on Home Improvement, Dunning would use her breaks between shoots to go riding. She grew up in Burbank and was surrounded by horse properties in her younger years. She says she's always loved horses and that even during her home improvement years, she would keep her horse at an equestrian center across the street. Between scene changes, she would typically have enough time to spend with her four-hoofed companion. Her series ran for three seasons until 2020. Production was forced to stop for the COVID-19 pandemic, but hopefully it will soon be able to pick up where it left off. Dunning is passionate about family and charity. Whenever she's not acting or touring dude ranches across America, Dunning enjoys spending her free time with her family out on the links or taking part in charity work. Debbie was married to former Olympic volleyball star Steve Thomas from 1997 to 2018. During their time together, they had three children, 
a daughter named Spencer Shea, and two sons, Stoney and Cisco. In a 2017 interview, Dunning was quoted as saying she's always had an active role in her children's lives, even though it's not always easy to do so. She credits her success as a mother to her strict yet open approach to parenting. She further said she loved being a mother and that when she was still on home improvement, she was able to bring her daughter to work with her every day since she was just two weeks old. As such, she never had to miss a precious moment or milestone. Debbie's also a big fan of golfing and skiing. She frequently makes appearances at the annual John Starks Foundation Charitable Golf Tournament, which raises funds to provide scholarships for college-bound students who otherwise wouldn't be able to pay for their schooling. Dunning was quoted as saying she always makes time to help children in need. She takes any opportunity where she can put her time into something that benefits children in her community. It's been a while since Dunning has appeared in anything on the big or small screen, but it's pretty obvious she's living relatively comfortably. According to most estimates, Dunning has a net worth of between four and five million dollars. A possible home improvement reboot. In 2015, Hollywood Life reported that Tim Allen and Richard Karn had been tossing around the idea of getting the home improvement cast back together for a reunion episode or a reboot series. In February 2020, Cinema Blend reported Tim Allen was still interested in reviving the sitcom. At the time, he expressed interest in bringing the show back for a one-off special where fans would get a chance to find out where the boys ended up and how Tool Time would fit in with the modern world. If this was to happen, it would be wonderful to see Debbie Dunning come back to reprise her role as Heidi. Now it's time to hear from you. Who was your favorite character in Home Improvement? Let us know in the comments section below. And before you go, make sure you give this video a like and subscribe to Facts First if you haven't already. Click the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content. By the way, if you haven't joined Facts First as a member yet, be sure to look below this video and click the join button. By becoming a paid member of Facts First, you'll get access to exclusive video content that you won't find anywhere else. This includes some of our more mature content that isn't suitable for public audiences, which includes topics like Hollywood actresses who posed for Playboy and some of the steamiest moments in movie history. Plus, you can enjoy these videos completely ad-free. Our biggest fans will notice they also get badges next to their name when they leave comments on our videos. We pay special attention to comments from our members and so do other viewers. So, if you want exclusive content from Factsverse or inside access to discussions with other community members, click the Join button to get started for just $4.99. There are hours of members-only videos waiting for you, with new videos added every month. And we're actively working on bringing even more features to help fans like you connect with other members and get more of your favorite content. Just click Join, and we'll see you inside the Membership tab.